One of the people that I admire most in life is somebody who started out as a failure and yet became one of the greatest industrialists of all time, and that's Henry Ford. And he said, if you believe you can, or you believe you can't, you're right. Belief is something that is a very easy word to say, but it's misunderstood by many people. Just thinking something is so does not necessarily make it a belief. A belief is a really strong thought, something that is almost unchangeable. It is a reality in your own mind, and because of that, it shapes who you are, what you are, what you will become. Belief is so important in your life. There are many people who are sceptical about so many things. They refuse to believe almost anything. And it's understandable in a, in a way because there are so many people out there that are dishonest and unscrupulous. And yet, if we adopt this scepticism in our lives, it stops us from having that belief, that trust in ourselves that will actually make positive changes for us. That is, if they're not limiting beliefs. Because limiting beliefs are, are what are held by the sceptics. They are what are held by so many people. They're things that are impressed upon us through life, not through bad thoughts of, of the people that create these beliefs. Often they're created through people wanting to protect us. They say, don't do that, it'll harm you. Don't do that, you'll get upset. Don't do that because, because, because. You can't, you can't, you can't. They're being protective, but what they're actually doing is they're establishing beliefs in people that are limiting. Money is hard to come by. Life is a struggle. These are limiting beliefs. You have to make the change from limiting beliefs to unlimited belief. Belief that you can achieve and do anything. Because your beliefs really do create your reality. And this is borne out by quantum physics. They've studied energy patterns. They've studied the way that the world works. They've studied the fact that a thought can change a material object. But that thought is weak until it becomes a belief. And when it becomes a belief, it is so strong that it can make everlasting changes in the way things work, in your own life and the way it operates. You know, I've always had a belief that no matter what, there will be sufficient money to do whatever I want to do. I don't value money. I don't want to accumulate money. Because I know there will always be enough money for me to do whatever I want to do. And that has held good for me. Even at times when I've had no money, I've always believed that there will be sufficient to put food on the table, to provide shelter. And things have always happened that have made that belief a reality. Your beliefs create your reality. And you have to be very determined to make sure that what you believe is what you truly want. Because with belief, the impossible becomes possible. There is a saying that to create the impossible, you must first believe it's possible. That belief must be strong, it must be embedded within you. Make sure, not just for today, but throughout life, your beliefs are in tune with what you want to become. Because what you believe you will become, you will become. God bless.